we're very privileged to have the, under, the Deputy Undersecretary here today to be a part of our National Advisory Council because of her extensive experience, first of all, in child nutrition, and also her experience with the National Food Service Management Institute. To have someone of Dr. Thornton's to the USDA and to us to see how we can work together more closely. I think finally people are understanding what an important part good nutrition plays in not just a child's education, and we all know from research that it does that, but also in the future of our country's health. Because more and more we're understanding that many of our diseases have uh, a base in poor nutrition. In the school programs, we are very interested in offering only healthy meals to children through the National School Lunch Program and the School Breakfast Programs. When you have a nutrition professional such as a registered dietitian who is responsible for planning menus and directing the operation of those programs, we're more likely to be able to meet our nutrition objectives with the meal services that we provide to our children every day. We are seeing now whole grains that many people don't have at home, but we have in school, and we're trying to teach kids that whole grain foods are good foods. We have a whole lot more fresh fruits and vegetables. Very few schools have deep fat fryers anymore, but those schools that do, it's not necessarily because they think that's the best. It's maybe that they don't have the money to replace that equipment so they can get the steamers or the, the combi ovens or the equipment they need to do the healthier product. Um, we have correct portion size, which again is so critical. If you go to most restaurants today, Often, what I see on my plate is enough for an entire family of four to eat. So we've got to help people learn correct portion sizes again. And we do that in school. Our meals meet the dietary guidelines for Americans. Most people don't realize that. The pizza we serve, and we have a lot of criticism for, for instance, has whole grain 